Hi, today I'm going to show you a couple of examples on how to carry out long division. Usually you tend to do long division when you're dividing by a two digit number. So let's have a look at example one. So we've got to work out 6916 divided by 19. Now what I've done first of all, I've just written down my first 10 multiples of 19. If you do this, this will save you time later on when you're doing your question. So you don't have to keep working out the multiples of 19. So it's worth spending a couple of minutes working those out. So let's go over the long division then. So first of all, you need to set your division out like so. So if you put the 6916 underneath the horizontal 9, and the number that we're dividing by will go at the start. Okay. So first of all, do 6 divided by 19. Well, we can't do that. So instead, let's do 69 divided by 19. So if I look at our multiples of 19, we've got 19, 18, 57, 76. So 76 is too big. So the best one we can do is 57. So if you write 57 underneath the 69, and if we write the 3 at the top, because 3 times 19 is 57. So we just need to now take 57 from the 69. So this leaves us with 12. Next, what you need to do is bring the 1 down to the next line. So what we need to work out now is 121 divided by 19. So again if we look at our multiples of 19 on the side of the page so what's the best one we can do? So we've got 19, 38, 57, 76, 95, 114, 133 so that's too big. So the best one we can do is 114. So again if we copy that underneath and it was 6 times 19 so we put the 6 at the top so again we just need to take these away now. So 121 take away 114. Uh, that leaves us with 7. So again we bring the next number down from the top. Which is a 6. So now we've got to do 76 divided by 19. So again look through your multiples of 19. 19 38, 57, 76, so 4 times 19 goes exactly. So if we put the 4 at the top, and as you can see, nothing is our remainder, which is what we expected. So let's do example 2. So this time we've got to do 7306 divided by 13. So again I've written down my multiples of 13 to save a little bit of time. So I don't have to keep working out my multiples of 13 as I go through. So again set it out in the same way. So we've got 7, 3, 0, 6 and we divided by 13. So 13 is into 7 doesn't go, so we need to do 13s into 73. So if I look at our best multiple of 13, 13, 26, 39, 52, 65, 78 is too big. So 65 is our best one, so that's 5 times 13. So if we write 65 underneath the 73 and put the 5 at the top. So now we just need to take 65 from 73. So that will give 8. So next bring down the 0 from the top. And we need to work out 80 divided by 13. So again look for your best multiple of 13 which we can take off. So we've got 13, 26, 39, 52, 65, 78. 91 is too big so 78 is our best one. So if we put 78 underneath, and that was 6 times 13, so we write the 6 at the top. So 
So then we just need to take the 78 from the 80. That gives us 2. So next, bring the 6 down from the top again. So we've made 26. So now we just need to do 26 divided by 13. So as you can see, 2 times 13 is 26. So we've put 26 there. Right, the 2 at the top. So if we take these away, as expected, we get 0 as the remainder. Thanks for watching.